Let's get you a sports report right now. It's Michael Patrick Shields on Wednesday. Heard all across the state of Michigan and live from our American Metal Roof Studio. Amanda Wall riding that motorcycle was a grand moment. She oh did my it goodness. right there on the television and on radio without a helmet, breaking the law. But first time she's ever been on the bike. So it's a grand moment indeed. And if you're interested in a um, visit to Grand Hotel, call 1-800-33-GRAND or go to Grand Hotel dot com and have a grand time we'll be broadcasting in fact monday morning from grand hotel and this friday morning more island time we'll be broadcasting from put in bay ohio that uh, lake erie island chain right there and smack in the middle of the lake so we'll be in lake erie on friday and uh, on monday we'll be in the straits of mackinac in between lake huron and lake michigan uh, the uh, u.s men's soccer team beat canada 2-0 on goals from uh, Josie Altador and Clint Dempsey at Ford Field in Detroit yesterday. It's the 12-team Gold Cup tournament and the tournament final June 25th, my birthday, at the Rose Bowl in Pasadena, California. We'll hear from Roger Faulkner, our soccer expert, tomorrow. Dirk Nowitzki scored 10 of his 21 points in the fourth quarter. The Mavericks came back and beat the Heat yesterday in Game 4 of the NBA Finals. LeBron James had only 8 points, and that series is tied at 2 games to 2. Uh, game five is Thursday in Dallas. I wonder if King James is getting a little bit nervous. I'm getting nervous about the NFL because there are reports that, uh, that there could be an eight-game season that would start in November, and plans are already being made for that possibility. Tiger Woods will not be playing in the U.S. Open at Congressional Country Club in Washington, D.C., still recovering from a knee injury. And the Columbus Dispatch says that Buckeye quarterback Terrell Pryor, who violated NCAA rules, is going to skip his senior season and go ahead and apply for the NFL supplemental draft. So he causes all that trouble and says, see ya, I'm going to go cash in. Floyd Mayweather Jr., uh, the six-time champion, is going to fight again welterweight champion Victor Ortiz, and that'll be September 17th at a venue to be named. And uh, national champion Auburn Tigers are going to be at the White House today. Speaking of the Tigers, they were winners yesterday in Arlington again, 8-1. to one. Television viewers, thanks for being with us. Radio listeners, stay right where you are. United States Senator Carl Levin will be with us next hour. It's Michael Patrick Shields.